Blockchain Exploration Service Blockchair has launched a new analytics tool. Blockchair feed decodes the messages that are written into the BCH, BTC, and ETH networks. The results can be viewed in a real-time feed comprised of messages that range from the banal to the enigmatic. Feast on a banquet of messages with Blockchair Feed Blockchain Explorer Blockchair is widely used by the Bitcoin Cash and Core communities for searching for transactions and checking data pertaining to market prices, dominance and network performance. It's also one of the few blockchain explorers that enables users to search for specific words or phrases hidden in transactions. Its latest tool goes a step further and decodes these messages in real time as they are published on each of the three blockchains. Blockchair Feed provides a fascinating and occasionally bizarre glimpse into the conversations that people are having, sometimes with specific people, and sometimes with the world at large. Via their favorite blockchain, most of the messages that can be viewed in the feed come from the BCH network. That's largely thanks to the success of microblogging social networks such as Memo and Block Press. Each of these capitalizes on the low fees of Bitcoin Cash, making it practical to message other users via the op underscore return field. Thanks to the recent upgrade to the BCH network, the size of this field has increased, giving rise to even more possibilities for on-chain communication. Of the two social networks, BlockPress has the cleaner UI which is reminiscent of Twitter. After creating a profile, header, and username, users can dispatch short messages that include emojis. Judging by the spate of messages appearing in the blockchair feed, however, Memo is the busier of the BCH social networks at present. As previously reported by news.bitcoin.com, people have been encoding messages in blockchains for years. The BTC blockchain, for example, contains six marriage proposals. Now, thanks to the rise of tools such as Blockchair Feed, coupled with services like Memo and Block Press, reading those messages, and even replying to them, has gotten a lot easier. Have you tried using Block Press or Memo yet and if so what are your thoughts on these services? Let us know in the comments section below. Thank you for listening to my channel. Please is subscribe for get hot news in the world.